Hi everyone, <coughs> uh, meet uh, Guillaume, my friend Guillaume. We uh, are both uh, team members of uh, First Robotics uh, team and also uh, Guillaume works with me and uh, you'll see him from time to time because he's uh, offered to uh, help me uh, with uh, restoring the machine. Here we are cleaning up uh, the assembly that uh, holds uh, the z-axis to the rails. Um, so I'm going to show you um, this assembly more in details once we're done cleaning it up. Okay, so uh, today uh, we're looking at uh, this uh, assembly which uh, holds the uh, z-axis to uh, the rails of uh, the machine. So this is bolted uh, straight into the casting and the rails are sliding uh, on this uh, part here, on this surface. Um, these here, uh, this one and this here and this at the other end are the gibs. That's what they're called. I can remove one. As you can see here, there's a, a screw and also um, you can see here that it's um, taper so it's thicker here and uh, thinner here and uh, this here is uh, this material is called tersite uh, it can be replaced with gibbs that are made out of uh, copper or you have these ones with uh, the tersite and this groove here is to uh, distribute uh, the way loop so uh, when you screw or unscrew this uh, screw here, the gib will move uh, in or out, which because it's taper will put more or less pressure on the rails, which is what gives the stiffness of the uh, z-axis, I guess. Um, I don't know yet how uh, this is adjusted, how much pressure you should put. I have no clue, so if you are... Um, Fadal owner and you know you have any uh, comments about that I'd be very curious to know uh, so the way loop comes uh, from uh, this line here in here and from this hole and it is distributed through this uh, groove here and um, I noticed there's also a port here for way loop but it, it's uh, you know it's uh, closed with a uh, set screw um, I'd also like to know if you're a Fedal owner um, if uh, on your machine this is uh, connected to a way lube I'm thinking of adding way lube here uh, I don't know um, on the uh, this was on the uh, right side if you're facing the machine is that right uh, no, on the left side if you're facing the machine and this one was on the right side uh, am I going to, yeah, yeah, that's right and for some reason uh, these here uh, these gibs uh, show hardly any sign of wear but uh, these one here um, show uh, quite a lot of wear the the the, the, the tersite is much thinner and it's it has started uh, delaminating uh, so uh, these will need to be uh, changed for sure um, yeah so uh, yeah that's it that's just what i wanted to show you so it's probably going to be a pretty uh, short video but uh, yeah thank you for watching till the end and uh, we'll see you uh, Soon, next time. Okay, bye.